Hello everyone, welcome back to another episode on Warp Suit Challenges and today we will be covering offline password cracking. So according to the description we have there is a access vulnerability and we have provided with the username and password and our victim as Carlos and also we have to delete the Carlos account. Okay, so we can access the lab. So in order to exploit access vulnerability there should be somewhere to comment our opinion. So I am just viewing a post. Yeah, we can make our comments. So in order to test whether a access vulnerability is working or not I am using some scripts on error. Okay, I guess it's over. It is posted and it is working. So the access vulnerability is active. Now it's time to enter our exploit. So I'm going to exploit server. and here they are providing a url to the exploit so i'm just copying it and writing a new script document.location and i'm pasting the link that i have copied and adding a plus, plus sign and to the cookie also so this should work and should give us a error hello world it means that the exploit is successful uh, so we can go to the access law, access law, and see here we are getting a different IP address. So this must be the information that we got using exploit. So here we are getting a secret key, and we can see a stay logged in, page 64. So I'm just copying that part. and pasting it in a decoder yeah it's carlos decoder as base64 and we are getting a hash value i'm just copying it and heading to crack station which is a online password hash cracking so it is probably an md5 hash we can just check it once upon a time so that is the password of that should probably be the probably be the password of carlos uh, anyway we are going back to home heading to account login here we can type carlos and password as once upon a time hello carlos so we could successfully login and head, head into my account section and delete the account here we, we have to again enter once upon a time and delete the account sorry yeah sold it was successful so there there is no account uh, 
uh, with Carlos username. So everything is possible due to the exploit that, uh, that the pursuer has provided. Uh, so if there is a vulnerability, we could still exploit uh, like the way we have exploited. Only only if the exploit is appropriate uh, according to the parameters. So guys, uh, our session is over. And if you like this video, show me some support. And don't forget to comment your opinions. Correct me if I am wrong or... Uh, somewhere I have to improve so see you in another video